And the Lord God took the man and put him into the garden of Eden to dress it and to keep it. And the Lord God commanded the man, saying, Of every tree of the garden thou mayest freely eat. But of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil, thou shalt not eat of it. For in the day that thou eatest, thereof thou shalt surely die. And the Lord God said, It is not good that the man should be alone. I will make him and help me for him. And out of the ground the Lord God formed every beast of the field and every pole of the air and brought them unto Adam to see what he would call them. And whatsoever Adam called every living creature that was named thereof. And Adam gave names to all cattle and to the fowl of the air, and to every beast of the field, but for Adam there was not found an help meet for him. And the Lord God caused a deep sleep to fall upon Adam, and he slept, and he took once to his ribs, and closed up the priest instead thereof. And the rib which the Lord God had taken from the man, made he a woman and brought her unto the man. And Adam said, This is now bone of my bones and place of my place. She shall be called woman, because she was taken out of man. Therefore shall a man leave his father and his mother, and shall cleave unto his wife, and this shall be one flesh. And they were both naked, the man and his wife, and were not ashamed.